What's up guys, this is AppSuck05, um, I'm making a video here, it's a tutorial for boot up animations on your Samsung Vibrant, um, basically you're going to have a, about, I'm going to give you three ways how to do it, um, we'll begin, first of all is, uh, you have the option to get a, a app called Absolute Systems, which is this guy right here click on that and it's a really really useful tool to have it is a paid app you can get it on the market uh, if you choose to find it somewhere else that's your own thing um, basically there's quite a few things you could do with this app but for this uh, video we're just going to talk about uh, the boot up animations it has a a folder here it's called download boot animations you click on that and if you're if the list that is currently running doesn't match what they have online it will update it for you automatically um, so you can check out the list here you can see it's it's quite a list here I mean there's, there's quite a few of boot up animations here um, so you won't get bored quickly uh, you can just pick one out click on it and it'll show you a preview <coughs> excuse me of um of the animation that you pick some take a little bit longer than, than to load than others i don't know why i just picked another one see there you go um just check out another one very quick see so basically this is so easy you could just pick whichever one you want and click this little button here it says install this little tab and it'll install it for you um you can tweak it around and you can um, change the destination folder for these so maybe if you just want to download them and, and have a folder full of them so you don't have to go into the app itself to uh, apply these um, you want to do it manually then you have that option um, but anyways uh, the whole point of having the the application for the most part is to not have to do it manually right I personally do it manually most of the time because I just got used to doing it that way I guess um but um so i'm going to show you how to do that now uh first of all oh i also want to say that uh that version of absolute systems i'm running on my phone uh it is an older version it just runs i like it better than the new one um but the new one works fine um so it's gonna it might not be a blue background like mine uh so basically you're gonna need root explorer uh you can get it off the market and you click on that you're gonna this is after you've already downloaded a boot up animation from from somewhere hopefully you go to akscriller.com and uh, check us out over there it is a five dollar month donation and you have access to a lot of custom ROMs and there's we have boot up animations on there there's a forum there's life uh, help people can help you over the phone there's a live chat room um it is it is it's totally worth it you guys to check it out it's uh if 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 you just want to come and check us out you know um just see for yourself you know anyway so you're going to scroll down in root explorer until you find the sd card folder once you find that you're going to scroll down to the download folder and then you're going to find the boot up animation that you had downloaded previously I have a few of here that I've already uh, um, renamed something different so I know what they are I usually um, rename it so it just says boot up uh, boot animation and then I uh, long press on it you're gonna hit a uh, copy and as you can see now you have the options down here it says paste or cancel so you're gonna scroll back up to where it says parent folder hit parent folder parent folder and now you're back out to the root you're gonna scroll down all the way down just about where it says system click on that now once you're into the systems you're gonna scroll down into the media folder go in there and here as you can see if you scroll down there's the boot up animation that comes with the phone um, in my case this is actually a different one but uh, you're gonna hit paste in here and it's gonna ask you if you want to override it and you hit yes it's fine there's no problem um, and that's 
basically the gist of it. You can back out of here, shut your phone off, reboot it, and you can check out your new custom animation. If for some reason this doesn't work for you, because some, some people uh, have issues with this uh, mountain um, RW up here, where it says, you see on the top of the tab of Road Explorer, um, I don't think you guys can see that, but this tab right here says Mount RW, and for some reason I'm one of those people that sometimes it just doesn't work for me i do flash a lot of roms and stuff sometimes i, cl I might clear my cache and it, and, it, and it takes care of the problem but uh i don't really worry about it too much because you have other options i'm gonna hit cancel right quick um sorry timed out on me hit cancel and i'm gonna back out of root explorer altogether so i'll show you how i do it usually you're gonna go to root explorer click on that and uh Go down to the SD card folder like we did before. You got to go find your custom boot up animation in the download folder. You're going to scroll down, long press on it, copy, go back up, parent folder, parent folder. Now, this time around, you're going to go to the folder that says data. Click on that, scroll down until you see the folder that says local click on that one and here as you can see I have a boot up animation this is where I put mine and it will work so once you're in here you just hit paste um, the first time you do it there's not gonna be one in here so it'll just paste it but afterwards when you do it like I do um, it's gonna ask you if you wanna override it and just hit yes um, if you do like I do where I rename them you're gonna have to uh, just remember which one you had in here so you're gonna end up having to rename it something else again so you remember which one it is uh, then you back out of here and reboot your phone and um, that's basically it I'll show you real quick how mine does this uh, this is the shutdown animation that comes uh, with this custom ROM I'm running. It's a LG Star ROM. Um, you can find it at akscriller.com in the forums. Um, I want to give uh, credit to the developer. Uh, dude's great. He has kept me posted, and not just me, everyone on the forum, on every little change he's done to it. He's been uh, polishing it, and I gotta say, it is it is a good product. Um, as you can see the phone's booting back up Samsung Vibrant from T-Mobile and um, here you'll see the custom animation boot up animation I got on my phone right now I've actually I got another video it's about 20 seconds showing the same one I've had it for maybe a week it's just I haven't got around to change it I usually change them every couple of days or so There you go. No more T-Mobile sticking together. Um, so that's it, guys. Thank you for your time. I hope you guys learned something. Uh, leave comments. Subscribe. I'm new. Um, it's a new channel, but I'm going to be uh, posting a lot of tutorial videos. And most of this stuff, you can find it, again, akscriller.com. It's a great website. Um, it's really worth it. So, if you guys like this stuff, you can find a lot more, a, a lot more like this, and and a lot, a, a lot of uh, people that know a lot more than I do on there that are willing to help you. So, akscriller.com. This app sucks. Till next time, guys. Bye.